good kids. They don't deserve this. You know, they don't deserve to have Christmas stolen. Gonna get into them. But tonight, the community is helping a family in Warren that got Christmas gifts stolen. Thieves broke into the family's car and took the gifts that were in the back seat. Good evening, I'm Dave Sess. Erica has the night off. Everyone wants a Christmas to remember, but a Trumbull County family nearly had one to forget after their gifts were stolen. But guess what? Christmas is back on. Derek Lewis will tell us who saved the day. He's live in the studio. Dave, the family says community, the, the community support has been overwhelming. Tonight, the parents of six children are trying to stay positive on Christmas Eve despite a terrible situation. It was, yeah, it was about 3 30, 4 o'clock in the morning, and we pounded on the door, and like, somebody's at the door, you, you know. And I uh, went to the door, and it was the police. Warren police told the DeMauro family someone had broken into their car. They had two bags of Christmas gifts for the children. One was in the trunk, and the other was in the back seat. It was just a bag. It's only a couple of days, and, you know, our kids are always rooting around trying to find what well, we got them every year, so don't really have a place to put them. Um, so we didn't figure it would be a problem. Uh, apparently it was. The gifts that were stolen were donated to the family from the Salvation Army. We're trying to do everything that we can to make our, you know, have our kids uh, you know, have a good Christmas. And, you know, something like this, you know, we're already getting help and then just gone. If we had went and bought the gifts and they got taken, I'd be like, okay, we're out of money. The fact that somebody took the time and their money to go buy my children Christmas gifts and then somebody who, in my eyes, is a thug, just snatches them away, I feel more violated and more upset about that. Trumbull County dispatchers got word of what happened. They were heartbroken. It's very emotional, and I don't think people realize that this job is a very emotional job. They are asking the community for help. Joe Shaker dropped off $100 for the family. We want to make sure that those kids know that there's uh, good people still out in the community and that uh, it, it was a bad, uh, terrible thing that occurred to them, but there's some good people out there that really hope they have a blessed Christmas. The parents say the four oldest kids decided they would give their gifts to the youngest ones so that Christmas isn't ruined for them. They're good kids. They don't deserve this. You know, they don't deserve to have Christmas stolen. Now, anyone who wants to help the family can drop off gifts at the Trumbull County 911 Dispatch Center on Howland Wilson Road, northeast in Howland. Dave? All right, Derek, thanks. Hey,